Hello everybody. Welcome to your English class. Today we are going to start unit 7 which is about celebrations. By the end of this video you will be able to recognize different types of celebrations classify them into different categories and use vocabulary related to celebrations now look at the word celebration what comes to your mind what do you think about good celebrations is about all these pictures look at number one. what's that number two. good look at number three. what are the people doing now look at number four the people with the, the red flags the flags of morocco can you name these celebrations very good number one women's day good two the emil shield festival right number three Eid al-Adha number four the Green March now can you classify these celebrations as follows local national international religious ramadan independence day mother's day eid al-fitr gnawa music festival Green March Festival of the Roses Thanksgiving Women's Day Ashura Throne Day Christmas New Year's Day Eid al Mawlid, Emil Shield Festival, Valentine's Day, Labor Day, Easter, and Halloween. Example Local Emil Shield Festival. National Green March International Women's Day Religious Eid Al-Adha Very good Gnawa Music Festival Festival of the Roses Where is the Festival of the Roses celebrated? Yes, it's celebrated in the village of Qal'at Mguna in where is it? Now, national celebrations Green March Independence Day 
thrown day. Now look at the international celebrations. Women's Day, Mother's Day, and Labor Day. Religious celebrations are Eid al-Adha, Eid al-Fitr, Thanksgiving, and Ashura. Now, read the following text and notice the words in bold. As in most countries, Moroccans observe different days according to the lunar calendar. During these days, they enjoy their time to the fullest and have festive moments. They also honor them, mainly religious ones. During these celebrations, kids often greet their parents in the early mornings. Also, these celebrations are occasions for adults to give gifts and donations to people in need, to recite the Holy Quran, and to do special prayers. Thus, Moroccan celebrations are good moments to instill social values. Good. Now, read the text again and fill in the chart with the appropriate bold word. Meaning. To put in someone's mind to show respect and gratitude presents such as flowers chocolate full of joy and fun things given out as a charity Mark as a special occasion. To say aloud from memory. And to welcome. Have you finished? Have a look at the correct answers. Put ideas in someone's mind. Instill. Show respect and gratitude. Honor. Presents, such as flowers and chocolate. Gifts. Full of joy and fun. Festive. Things given out as a charity, donations, mark as a special occasion, observe, say aloud from memory, recite, welcome, greet. Good. Now, let's do a practice exercise. Fill in the blanks with the appropriate words from the list below. Festive. Instill. Greet. Observe. Honor. Gifts. Moroccans Green March on November the 6th every year. 
Most people each other by shaking hands. Mother's Day is celebrated on March the 8th to mothers. Ashura is uh, and serious moment at the same time. Now, take some time and do the task. Now, check your answers. Number one. Right. Observe. Moroccans observe Green March on November the 6th every year. Number two. That's right. Greet. Most people greet each other by shaking hands. Have a look at number three. Honor. Mother's Day is celebrated on March the 8th to honor mothers. What about the last one? That's right, festive. Ashura is a festive and serious moment at the same time. Well done, everybody. I hope that you have benefited so much from today's lesson and have learned so much vocabulary related to celebrations. Now, it's your turn to tell us about how people celebrate Eid al-Adha in your region. Thank you very much. See you next time.